On the eve of New Year's Eve, many of you are probably trying to make plans to ring in the New Year with a bang. And while making those plans, you're encouraged to add finding a safe ride home to your list. No one wants to start the new year on the wrong foot, but you could be in for an expensive mistake if you decide to drink and drive after ringing in 2017. It'd probably be about between eight and ten dollars. Well, so yeah, that's a lot better than you know a ticket for drunk driving. Cab drivers in the Greenville area say the savings are something to celebrate. DWI lawyers we spoke with today say getting behind the wheel while drunk can cost you more than ten thousand dollars. First, there are initial costs like bail, operating with a suspended license, and retaining a lawyer. That alone will cost you upwards of $3,500. If convicted of driving while intoxicated, the fees keep stacking up. Your fine alone could be more than $4,000, and your insurance premiums will likely jump 400 percent. That cab ride doesn't sound too inconvenient now. And if you're an Uber user, the app is reminding those celebrating New Year's Eve out in the town that prices will jump between midnight and 3 a.m. You will be asked to accept those premiums before accepting the ride. Most importantly, finding a safe ride could save your life. That's priceless. The CDC says between 2003 and 2012, 4,102 people were killed in crashes involving a drunk driver in North Carolina. We just encourage everybody, if you are going to drink, don't drive. And, uh, you know, don't put yourself at risk or the safety of others. So this year, celebrate responsibly to ring in the best year yet. It's illegal in North Carolina to drive a vehicle with a blood alcohol content of 0 .08 or higher. The number of drinks it takes for a person to achieve that BAC varies, so it's better to be safe than sorry.